Welcome to Skylight's training videos. This video will teach you about dark rendezvous events in Skylight. In Skylight, an icon showing two arrows, one solid, the other dashed, crossing one another indicates a dark rendezvous. A dark rendezvous is when a single vessel transmitting AIS displays tracks resembling potential at sea transshipment. This behavior includes slowing down and making loitering maneuvers. These events are considered dark because the other vessel that is potentially part of the transshipment is not transmitting AIS. The technology behind this event is based on subject matter experts who help Skylight identify vessel tracks resembling transshipment events. Their input was used to train a machine learning model to recognize such behavior. To avoid too many false positives, Skylight only shows dark rendezvous events more than 100 kilometers from the coast. A similar icon, where two arrows crossing each other are both solid, represents a standard rendezvous. For more information about standard rendezvous events, where two vessels are both transmitting AIS, check out Skylight's separate video specific to standard rendezvous events. In areas where there are both standard and dark rendezvous events, it can be helpful to filter your results to look at one event type at a time. For this example, let's filter by nationality, only dark rendezvous events and by the fishing vessel type fish carrier, which is otherwise referred to as a reefer. Note that once filters are applied, the list of events will update to what is shown on the screen. By clicking on the dark rendezvous arrows icon, you will see information about the vessel as well as the segment tracks representing the movement of the vessel. The event details card shows information about the vessel, such as the MIMSI and vessel type. It also shows the time, location, and duration of the event. Transshipment confidence is also provided. The confidence measure is based on vessel types and the duration of the potential rendezvous and transshipment. Duration is the key factor in the algorithm, so high confidence commonly indicates a longer period of time where two vessels could have been meeting. On the other hand, low confidence can indicate vessel types that are unlikely to have made a transshipment of any sort or simply that the potential interaction between two vessels had a very short duration. Where possible, Skylight also provides a list of nearby vessels who have recently transmitted AIS. Vessels transmitting another signal like VMS or not transmitting anything at all do not appear in this list. For any vessel shown in the Dark Rendezvous event details card, clicking the vessel's name will open a new tab showing the vessel's history and other useful information. From this page, clicking the download icon and selecting the file type will download the vessel's history back on the main view of events. If the filtered list on the right-hand side of the page and visible on your screen are of interest, you can download them by clicking the download icon and choosing the file type. For more information about dark rendezvous events, see the user guide under the My Skylight tab. You are also welcome to use the contact us email at support at skylight.global as well as messaging your Skylight representative. For more information about all of Skylight's functionality, Take a look at our other videos.